Hello and welcome to Hypothetical Hypocrite, a channel where I'm a hypocrite but I'm hypothetical about it. My name is Jeremy and here I play video games and just plain try to be entertaining. As you can see here I'm going to be playing some more Undisputed for you today. This is the second fight of our Sunday and I won the first one and hopefully we can continue that into the second one. Uh, like I said in the first video for today I haven't uh, won a three streak in any of the times that I've fought for our Sundays and Hopefully we can change that and do that today. Hopefully I'm not jinxing myself by saying that, but, you know, we're going to try our hardest and try our damnedest. So, But before we get started, if you do enjoy this type of content, please remember to hit the like and subscribe buttons, leave a comment and share. Any one of those would be great, but all four would be amazing just like you are. And with that being said, let's get this game rolling. Alright, get our prize fights going. And if you could subscribe, by the way, um, I'm going for a goal of 100 subscribers by the end of the year. Uh, I think that's a pretty good goal for a one-year goal, since I'm just starting out and doing something that a ton of people already do, and, you know. But anyway, looks like we're fighting with Corolla, with Krola and Gotti. I think I've done this fight before, but with Gotti versus Krola. So, we'll see what happens here. Six knockdown limit. Wow. Okay. So they're expecting a lot of knockdowns. And he's got the reach advantage on me. So, yeah. Let's have some fun. I'm guessing Krola's a newer fighter. Gotti's a 90s and there's fighter. Nothing quite like a CompuBox he was a Academy great fighter crowd, in the 90s. And they are both... Anthony... This bout... One of the hot... All right. These two fighters promised us an offensive show. Let's see if they deliver. Quick punch scores. Firepower here. Off the charts action from both of these fighters. Come on, buddy. Threw the hook, didn't land. They exchanged punches. Caution being thrown to the wind. Come on, Gotti. Play with me. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. Counterfighter relies a lot on their instincts and reaction time. You've got to get in there quick to punch your opponent before he gets his fist back to block. You're fighting a counter puncher, you've got a dummy shot. Make them react from that, then react then. I know it's hard to think that way, but counter punchers, they're watching you. Ooh, watching I'm going through my stamina like nothing. Reaction is second to none. It's the blink of an eye, and they're waiting for any little twist you do. So you've got to fight a counter puncher smart. Nice offensive display landing that left counter. We wanted action, and they are giving us action. Round still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. Perfect counter lands. You know they've got the advantage so far, but how does this is going to be a slug fest. And look at my stamina. Holy crap. Here we go. It's round two. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. What can you expect between these two lighter weight fighters? Remember, with the lighter weights, you're expecting at least 300 shots around. They can let these shots go. They can move their fast, they're sharp. That's a hard night work for the referee. Great 
counter right hand there. They're both trying for a knockout. Lands with the right counter. Good counter punching for both these athletes. Stepping back is Corolla. Anthony Corolla. Damn. How did that just happen? It just all of a sudden I was stunned for nothing and then down. At some point the corner may have to intervene here because this fighter won't stay down. Some fighters, when this happens, this can be heartbreaking. Some fighters, it makes them angry. They want to get back into the mix again. I want to know, what sort of character are we looking at here? Why are they throwing punches? They should be playing defense right now. He's not much of a power puncher. My stamina is just gone. Okay, final 10 seconds. Wow, God, he just got clipped. And down goes Gotti. Got him. No save by the bell. And he's cut. That count should have kept going to at least seven. Both men getting off the Tied it up there. On to the third. Both fighters went to the canvas last round. What are we going to see here? That is showing the fitness. That is showing the stamina. That is showing the hard work done in the gym. If you can get knocked down and get back up and knock your opponent down in the same round, it's an 8-8 eight, eight round, but that's how it rolls. And that has rocked Arturo Gotti. Keeping those gloves up. Oh, look at Gotti. I don't know if he's going to survive. Is he out on his feet here? Oh, and that big shot got Arturo Gotti. He's wobbly. He's stumbling around. And Gotti goes down. Ooh. Can I, can I do this? Can I beat him? Oh, he's bloody. He's real bloody. So they'll make it up, and this fight continues. Whoa, and God, he got clipped there. This could be the end. Oh, look at Gotti. I don't know if he's going to survive. Gotti goes down. Ooh. This is a great fight. I'm enjoying this. And Gotti's known for going down and getting back up a bunch of times. Come on. Well, they're back up on their feet, but I'm not Come on. sure why. And that just rocked Arturo Gotti. This is serious business now. Can he get out of this big pressure situation? Nice. And at the end of the round. Three times in one round. And that's it. That's two for two. Woo! That was a good fight. I enjoyed that a lot. Not many people would have predicted it, but we've got a knockout victory. Well, there's no argument right there. Not that you say it. Night, night. Yep, night, night. It started out as if it was going to be bad with that knockdown. And I came back roaring. Alright. I hope you guys enjoyed that as much as I did. It was a lot of fun, as always. And hopefully I can keep this streak alive in the next fight. And hopefully you guys will stick around and join me with that next fight. And uh, if you do enjoy this type of content, you know what to do. Hit the, those buttons down below. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. And let me know if there's any fighters you want to see fight against, see me fight with and against. So, yeah. But with that being said, I hope you all have a great one. And I'll see you in the next video.